everybody, it's Laura. Welcome back to my channel. I am going to do a plan with me and my B6 inserts. I've pulled it out of my planner because my planner is real chunky right now and it's a little wobbly to plan in. <laughs> um, I'm going to be using this kit from Glam Planner, but I thought I would flip through my spreads from when I was gone on vacation real quick. I did post these on Instagram because I did travel with this planner and it worked out really great. Um, but... I still think I prefer my Erin Condren. <laughs> so this was station stickers, two little bees, and a whole bunch of foil. Um, there's hollow foil and silver foil. Um, I think it turned out really, really cute. I think there were some planner spreads before this one, but they're in a different insert. So I'll just show you the ones in this insert. Um, this is the second page. And then... This is Two Little Bees with mostly my newest addiction. There's some rose colored days in there too. You can see the little mischief managed and <laughs> things like that. And then page two is like this. And then I had Beloved by Him. It is currently Saturday, so I need to go back and fill these in. I've been you know, just trying to get reorganized and settled into my apartment living and things like that again because I was gone for so long. <laughs> so I got a little behind in this planner, but I'll catch up. Um, somebody was asking, I think Steph was asking how I was going to write on the black um, stickers. So I could have used a white pen, but um, I didn't want everything in black and then this one in white. I thought it would be weird. So I did write with black pen and you can see like Rec Plan With Me, Hungry Root on there, like when it hits the light and because I have so many planners, like, it's not that big of a deal. I can still read it. <laughs> um, I actually think it's a little hard to read on these checklists, even though I love them so much. It is a little hard to read on these, like, where it gets dark. Um, but, you know, you make it work. It's totally fine. <laughs> and then this is page two. Again, I still have some areas that I can fill in. And then, like I said, it's Saturday right now. So there we are at. And again, I did a lot of blue spreads and then that one red spread. So I, was, I got this in the mail. I think I'm doing this video before this haul goes up. So I apologize for the sneak peek, but <laughs> um, I couldn't help it. I love this artwork so much. I think it's really, really fun. Like, look at this octopus in the Slytherin common room. Come on. It's so cool. It's like under the water and it's just so cool. So I was really excited to use this. And because it was green, it was something different. Um, it also came with I Bought Stuff and Glam Planner new releases. I don't think I'll be using this. I'm on a no spend. <laughs> um, and then this is the Essentials Kit. So you do get the double box. And then you get three pages that all have this like sidebar washi that you can stack up. It is cut, um, or this one is cut. I don't know if the other ones are cut. I don't think so. This one is cut like into these little chunks. I think it's so that you can stack it. I don't exactly know how it works, but you also get this stacked washi. So, you know, I, we'll figure it out together. <laughs> um, and then is this in focus? I'm not sure. Okay, there we go. So you get seven full boxes in the Slytherin theme, but then again, you get a double box. So you really get nine and then you get five of the full heart checklists. Um, you get a full set of today to do and littles headers. You get quite a few little things. You get seven half boxes and then some like sidebar headers, a full size and a mini weekend banner, movie marquee, four little heart checklists, which is nice because um, you only get five of the other kind. So you'll need two more if you like to do seven. Um, deco, flags, appointment label, nope, habit tracker, buy these. Um, these are washi strips. This is a chunk of washi, I think. So if you did this in Erin Condren, you could put those together and make a longer one. And then this would be the shorter one or whatever. Habit tracker and asterisks. So it's been a while since I've planned and inserts are always a little crazy. <laughs> um, but I'm going to put the double box on Saturday, Sunday because I have Pilates Tuesday, Thursday. So they're going to be a little bit, I mean, not full, but like just a little bit different than the other days. So I didn't want to try to like chunk two days together. So I think I'm going to do them over here and I'm trying to decide if I want to bring in some like foil headers because I just think this kit is so stunning. 
So I rearranged my stickers last night. So I have a happy scrappy album now. Um, actually, I've got two of them. And I think those are in the haul also. <laughs> so I have these, this green, I have mint green. Um, and then in this one, I have like hollow and silver. So I have silver, black, shattered glass, hollow, hollow. Oh, and then I have the hollow header overlays. I don't think I'll use those this time though. All the gold can stay here. Oops. Go in there. Okay. So I just think, I just think it's so stunning. I think this is, I don't know. I don't think I want to use that light green, but maybe because some of the boxes do have it on there, but I think definitely the dark green. I have nine of those. And then I just think hollow would be so cool. Maybe I'll just do the regular hollow instead of the shattered glass as much as I love this. Um, I think it'll compete with the glitter in the kit and I don't wanna make the kit look less impressive. Um, and then I have black. I think we'll leave those out. We'll leave these out. I think the silver, I think, okay, I think that's good. So, how many black ones do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, so 12. Um, maybe I'll do black above the full boxes. I don't know, you guys. I think I might do the mint. <laughs> Even though I said I wasn't going to, if I put the mint with the check boxes, I think it'll look funny, but I think it'll pull in quite a bit of what's in the full boxes. So I think I'm gonna do mint above, above the full boxes. So I'm going to put a header down. I could perhaps zoom in so you could see. Um, these are the Jessenia plans or Jessenia printables. <laughs> um, week on three pages with like a note section or something. I have the exact or I will have the exact printable link down below so that you're not guessing which is which if you are interested in this printable. I really hope this is straight because there's no way I'm pulling it up. <gasps> Thank you. Oh my gosh. It's so cool. Stephanie, this one's for you. Who else is a, ra uh, not a Ravenclaw? Who else is a Slytherin? I know I have quite a few Hufflepuff girls. I love you guys. You guys are the sweetest. Steph is super sweet too though and she's Slytherin. Just saying. <laughs> Slytherin is like my wannabe house just because I love green and silver <laughs> so much. I love, 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 love those colors. So especially together and with black, like it's just stunning. So it's my wannabe house. Um, I think I might just stay on this page. I'm a little lost right now. <laughs> so I think I'm going to stay here and we're going to do, let me look at those little checklists. So I have those colors. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll do the dark green and the silver. And I think, I think I'm gonna do the dark green. Maybe the, no, maybe the hollow headers. I'll do, these are from my newest addiction. The light green were from Rose Color Days. You guys know I'm like, I mean, Rose Color Days is my foil dealer. Like, she's got the crack, but um, I'll take foil wherever I can get it. <laughs> I have a problem. Okay. And then I think I'll do, like I said, the lightest and the darkest just for fun. And I don't know what's going on this coming weekend. As of right now, I have nothing planned. So I'm not worried about how many checklist things I have. It should be fine. Okay, then 
Uh, I might put Simply Gilded Slither and Washi on the bottom here because even the sidebar washi will be too thick for that area. So, and then Weekend Banner. All right. We'll put this underneath here. Hopefully not go off the page. And then I can put some little things down here if I need to. Well, I, I will because I'll do a filming schedule. Or I can do a filming schedule on the sidebar. I don't know. Okay, so then on this side, do I want... I did check boxes at the top and then I did all over. And then I did full at the top. So maybe I'll just do the same all the way across. I'll do full boxes at the top on this one. Um, so I was gone. If you want to hear about my vacation, I talk about it in my Erin Condren plan with me, which I will link above. So hopefully this one's a smidgen shorter. <laughs> um, I just don't feel like I need to say the same things over and over again even though I do sometimes. But my vacation was great. Thank you guys for bearing with me with all the pre-filmed videos. I think this one is crooked. And it feels so good to be planning again. Um, I love doing this, it's so fun. Which is good, because it's not like this makes me money. <laughs> um, so, you know, it's just a hobby, but it's so cool. Okay, so Slytherin, I think, will go on the sidebar. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, right. I have extra. Oh, and then I have, like, a double box scene here also. So... You know, I don't love the nail one, so I think if I don't get that one in, I'm not going to be heartbroken. I mean, it's kind of cool, but the nails kind of freak me out, <laughs> if I'm being honest. So let's put the blue. Ooh, that's crooked. Let's put the blue in the middle, and then I'll have green here and green here. Slytherin in the corner. Um, so we'll put the bedroom. Oh gosh, let's do this correctly. This is the other half, right? Yes, okay. I just got confused for a minute. <laughs> Pardon me. Um, I don't know what I was saying. Anyways, I have a date today. I haven't been on a date. I mean, I dated a guy for a year. So... Obviously, we went on dates, but <laughs> I haven't been on a date with somebody new in over a year. Um, so I'm a little nervous, but I already know this person. Um, so it's not like I need to be nervous, but I just don't know if I'm making a mistake or not. And that's really scary. <laughs> Tell me if you can relate. Oh my gosh, these looked blue sitting on my computer, so I couldn't find them. That was really weird. And then I realized, why do I have blue headers out? And I'm like, oh, they're probably not blue. <laughs> they're probably green. I think the light was reflecting funny from the computer screen. That was so weird. Okay, and then I'm going to put the Slytherin one up here, like I said. So yeah, I already know this person. Um, we're just going to Starbucks. We haven't seen each other in like three years. So, you know, we're just going to catch up and stuff. Kind of figure it out. But this other guy I was talking to that I thought I was going to be going on a date with in like a week or two when he got back. We, like, 
had an argument last night because I didn't want to get pregnant before I got married. And he was like, those aren't the trends in America. What do you think you're doing? You're 35 already. You're not going to be able to get pregnant. So you might as well see if you can get pregnant first. Otherwise, if you get married first, then you're just leaving the guy high and dry. And I was like, holy moly. I was like, this is not going to work out. So that was wild. <laughs> um, he seemed really cool. We've been talking for weeks, but because I was out of town and now he's out of town. So we've just been talking on the phone, but I was like, whoo, man, <laughs> I don't know if I can do this. Um, okay, now I'm going to put my checklist down. And these are kind of in an ombre, so I'm going to try to follow it. So I put the hollow headers from my newest addiction first. I don't know if I'm going to have room for bottom washi. To be honest with you guys, like I always think these have a ton of room and then I'm like, oh, I've already used it all. This one is all crooked. It's making me sad because these other ones are so straight. But because this is just like printer paper, I mean, it's like resume paper, but it's really hard to pull stuff off of because it gets all fibrous on the sticker. This is so pretty. Holy moly. So, like I said, I have this one box left. It's not my favorite. I don't mind it. It's just not my favorite. I prefer these ones, especially the bottles, the room, and the octopus double scene. I really love this crest, too. It looks like a glass window. It's really neat. Um, so, if I pass up on this one, it's okay, but I might have room for it, you know, over here or something or at the bottom. So, I might still get it in. If you love it, don't be sad yet. <laughs> Um, uh, okay, then I have a habit tracker. I'm going to need another one. I wonder what I should use. Um, I have silver foil ones, but they look very, very different than that. Although I don't necessarily need to have another one. I think I might just skip it because I have my Erin Condren and I might just put this in and call it a day because this is not my main planner so it's not a huge deal and then should I try to fit the bottom washi in then I only have room for a few little things but like what else do I need but if something comes up I'm not gonna want that space filled up so maybe I should use the skinny bottom washi It's kind of off from the color, but I think it'll work. It's like a little bit brighter. It makes the darker greens in the kit look a little bit more olive, but because there's different shades of green in the kit, I think we're going to be okay. These ones are kind of squeaky when I'm <laughs> putting them down. Hopefully this isn't a mistake using the green. I think the black would have looked really cool too, but whoa. And yes, I need to trim my bottom washi. I'll do it later. It's down. It's good. <laughs> so what have you guys been up to? What's new in your lives? What do I need to know? I missed you guys. Thank you for still commenting even though I was gone. I appreciate it. I love hearing from you guys. It's so fun. I 
Okay, we have seven stars, so I'll use these for my videos. I have a video going up every day this coming week, which is a little crazy. Um, but whenever we get towards the end of the month, I have more videos because I have monthly spreads for my Erin Condren and for my uh, B6 planner. And then because I was on vacation and I ordered a bunch of stuff, I have some hauls. <laughs> so it just sort of piled up, which I think is fine. You know, watch what you want to watch, and if you don't want to watch something, don't watch it. If it gets overwhelming or whatever. Okay, then I'm going to put these at the bottom of each of these days, and then I'll try to fit the header on top. But if I try to put the header on first, I've got nothing to line it up with. So hopefully this will work. <laughs> hopefully I won't be too crooked. I love this like pistachio green color. It's so cute. Okay, and then two cutters. I don't think I have anything else. I have like a build you this day and stuff, but I don't have to necessarily write it there because you have all of this stuff. So I can put it in like, don't forget. Because I'm not covering that. That's for darn sure. <laughs> Okay, so I have two of those green headers left. I might use those still, we'll see. Um, oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, so then I have Pilates on Tuesday. I have room for a half box here. Maybe I'll stick a half box here because I won't put a half box probably every day. Um, well, I know I won't put them on the weekend, so I for sure have some. Um, so maybe I'll put this one and that way I can write whatever else I need to. It layers onto the washi just a smidgen, but that's fine. Okay. So like I said, I have Pilates on Tuesday and I have Pilates on Thursday and then this will be dinners. So because I didn't do that for the little things. And since I put my videos, I can use the dinners header here. That will be dinners. I need to get a hydrate sticker out. I wonder if those are in the same thing here. Let me find those. Okay, I had to upload footage. So while it was uploading, I took the time to put the Simply Gilded Bottom Washi down. So this is the um, House Pride Washi or whatever in the Slytherin color. So it's greens and silver um, and it's a stripe, I think. All right, my camera is being dumb, but <laughs> um, so again, these are from Plants and Plants. Her shop is not open, I apologize. And then I put two half boxes down and then I use these workout stickers from Rose Colored Days. These were from an oops, like grab bag thing, so they're not foiled, but they still work perfectly. I still love her non-foiled grab bags also because I love her fonts and things. So there's that. Um, and then I think the only other thing I have is that bill that I have on the 28th, but I'll put it in my don't forget section up here, but I think I'll just do, um, this little dollar sign and we'll put that on the first line so I don't forget about it. Um, I still have these flags in here. I don't want to forget about those. And then I have Deco, a bad a credit card. I'm just kind of taking an overview, seeing what I have. Okay, I have a planner. So that will be on Friday. And then I have this really cute uh, script sheet from my newest addiction, and it says plan in this really pretty font. So I think I want to use this. And I'm going to have to layer it, I think. I don't know where I want to do this. <laughs> um, it's kind of big. Maybe I'll just cover the heart 
and then not worry about it. That way I can move it over a little bit. So I'm not covering as much. That planner is so cute though. It says Slytherin. It looks like this, this box on the front of the planner. And then it's green to gold, green to silver, glitter, ombre. <laughs> that was a mouthful. Okay. Uh, I'm going to be getting happy mail at some point. I'm not sure when. And then I don't know. This deco is all like yellowy and I'm just not feeling it. I don't, I don't know. Like it's cute deco. I just feel like it doesn't go with this spread. I feel like it's not going to add anything to it. So I'm not sure I want to put it down. Um, and then like I did on some of these other um, like I made this into two different sections and had thick bottom washi here. I made four sections. I think I might do that here because I have the washi to use. So I don't know. Let's see. Um, Cause this will be like the width. Oh no, I'd still have to trim that one. So I guess it doesn't matter. So maybe I'll just trim this to be the width of these boxes. I might have to re-trim, but that's okay. I cleaned up the washi edges also when I was off camera. So how big do I want this? Like here maybe? I try to make them a little bit uneven so that I have kind of, if there's something longer to write and then something shorter to write. Okay, so let me trim that. All right, so there's that section. And then I don't need the work to do section. Um, so I might find a label to put over that, but I'm not sure what I'll use yet. And then happy thought next week priorities to do. I can probably use all of those things. Just the work to do header, which means I might make these match. So where would I have something that I could use? Okay. So I've pulled out a few different date cover options. I have these green ones from Scribble Prints Co. And then I have a bunch from my new, um, my new section. These are rose colored days. I don't know if those boxes are even going to fit at the top there, though. I think they're too high. Yeah, those are going to go off the page. So we're going to use these ones from <laughs> Scribble Prints Co. And I just got like a, the whole like bundle or whatever. Um, so you get like all these rainbow colors. This is like the green and blue page or whatnot. And then I'll need some numbers. 23 through 29. It is almost the end of July and I'm freaking out. <laughs> so we, I have this week, the one that I'm planning. And then the week after that, and then I go back to work. So that's nuts. <laughs> oh my gosh, that looks really cute. Okay, numbers. Okay, so I took some tweezers and I put those down. These are from Rose Colored Days and they're like that shattered hollow instead of the like smooth hollow here, but that's fine. They're really cute, they're clear, so um, they just sort of layer really nicely. I really, really like how that looks. Okay, let's see what else I have in the kit real quick. So I have that one full box and some washi left. And then I have, like I said, I don't think I'm going to use that deco. I do have another deco sheet out though. This is from the Standard Essential. Um, it's on matte paper, but I might add some of this. So let me leave that out. I also pulled out my newest addiction, the robes laundry, because I'll probably have to do laundry. I pulled out Jalen Paper Co. These are like the evil characters. I feel like I don't want to put characters though. 
I might put Bippity, um, but I feel like the spread is so elegant right now that I don't want characters. <laughs> um, and then I have some icons and flags and stuff like that. And then I have half boxes, little things, and headers, and more sidebar washi. So I have a ton left, but I don't know. I'm loving this so far. So here are the first two pages. Really, really cute. Maybe I'll put some deco down here. I feel like it looks just a little strange. Um, maybe the pillow. Just to kind of add something. That's adorable. Um, and then we have this side, which obviously this, end, this side look, ends up looking... Oh, that's what I needed boxes for. I was like, what was I getting those for? So I could use those here and here. They're more like a label, but it doesn't have to be big. And that way I can label them with whatever this ends up being. I'm not sure what it will be yet, <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you. Usually I've, I've been writing memories, like things that have happened. You can barely see that. Um, I've been writing like things that have happened or stuff like that. It's really fun, um, which is something I can't do in my Erin Condren because that's like all planning. So this gives you a little bit more room to write, which is pretty cool. So I like that. Um, I might, I have those two green headers left. I think I might put one at the bottom of each of these boxes just to sort of finish it because I think that looks cute. Just to give it a little something something. I like that. And then the sheet is done, so I can be done with that. Okay, so that is the second half, or the second, the last part, and this is the first part. You guys, I'm in love with this kit. <laughs> I love the green. Um, and then, like I said, I can add more deco, especially on this page, once I kind of know what I'm writing and know how much room I have. So pretty. Oh my goodness. And then I have these really cool laundry stickers. So I think that's everything, you guys. I know I don't have a ton like going on, but I'm a teacher on summer break, like I keep saying, and I just don't have a lot of plans at the moment. So I have Pilates both of these days. I have a bill due later in the week, and then I have a video every single day this week. So look forward to that. But other than that, I don't really have things going on. I'll have to clean and do laundry and stuff, but I'm pretty bad about making a schedule. I just sort of do it when it needs to do or when it needs to be done. Um, so let me know what you guys think. And again, this was a kit from Glam Planner. It was a pre-order. I don't know if they'll be back or not. But definitely keep your eyes out for that if you are interested. It obviously came in a smaller kit and the Lux kit also. I just figured I would try the essentials this time and it worked out really well and I still have so many stickers left. <laughs> so we'll use those at some point. Um, but yeah, I think this is really cool. Again, if you're interested in this printable, I will link it down below. And at some point during this video, I should have had the printable tutorial linked as well if you don't know how to do printables. They're really easy as long as you have a printer or a way to get a printer or something printed and then either scissors or a paper cutter. That's all you need. Okay, I will catch you guys in the next video. Hit subscribe if you haven't already and you like these videos. There will be many more to come. Um, and I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for sticking with me. Have a great day. Bye.